The latest on the controversial sentence of a convicted drunk driver. David Hazard will spend the next seven years behind bars for causing the crash that claimed the life of Catherine O'Toole. O'Toole's family and representatives from the group Mothers Against Drunk Driving were in court and tell us they were hoping a harsher sentence would have been handed down. Tonight, we ask our legal analyst to weigh in on the judge's decision. New at 6, Eyewitness News reporter Marilyn Scherer is live with more from the Mobile Newsroom. David Hazard apologized to the O'Toole family in court for killing their mother while driving drunk. And then he pled guilty, not knowing what the sentence would be. Well, the O'Toole family and others say he got off too easy. The anguish was evident on the faces of Catherine O'Toole's children as they asked the judge for the maximum sentence for David Hazard, the man who killed their mother while driving drunk and drugged in 2009. The magistrate instead sentenced Hazard to serve seven years in jail with 18 years suspended. I've been a prosecutor my whole career, but I also do defense work, yes. so I've got a very balanced view of it. But, uh, yeah, they have a right to be upset. Eyewitness News legal expert Lou Polner says given Hazard's lengthy criminal record, he had 13 driving violations since 1995, the sentence is low. He's got a horrible driving record, and, and, and that's a fair question for the family to ask. Uh, they're obviously hurt. They're, they, they've suffered great tragedy and loss. And, uh, seven years to them, I'm sure, seems like a, a slap on the wrist. But Polner says the decision rests with the judge, who reviews an extensive report from the probation department before handing down the sentence. I can't say it surprises me. I can say that I you know, gave it one of those, hmm, uh, when I heard that he was only serving seven years. And now, the magistrate also suspended Hazard's driving license for five years. He fined him $600 and is requiring him to do one hour, 100 hours of community service and also to undergo substance abuse counseling. It's expected that Hazard will serve his jail time at the ACI. Reporting live with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, Marilyn Shara, Eyewitness News. Eyewitness